Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another BJ and Co video. Savvy, are you excited for what we got going on today? Oh boy! <laughs> Am I ever? Well, we, we've got a neat one for you guys. Um, we found out through the grapevine that uh, a gentleman we knew from school has actually put together a development company and put out this game. Uh, it's put together by 33 is the developer and it's run gun jump gun available on yeah. steam for less than 10 bucks which is pretty sweet my my favorite is dopest kind of games so ben's <laughs> playing yeah i think don't we have one on the the video of you trying to play a game like this yeah it doesn't go well usually <laughs> so we want to show you some of the game so we figured ben should do it because i wouldn't get past the first level yeah and we want to see what uh what Savvy's impressions of it are. I'm quite excited to see it. It's also available on mobile, which is kind of cool. So we're just going to go right into the first level here. And see what we got. It's pretty simple. There's two... Um, you've got two controls. Left shift to drop. Don't tap it. I think I can handle that. What happens if you tap it? it you don't do quick enough. So, this is kind of cool. I'm using so my gun to actually go up. So now, what happens if you, like, get stopped? Does the screen kill you? Yes. Bingo. There you go. just get pushed back, not... Well, depends how far. But that wasn't bad at all. That's not bad. Okay, and right Oh, shift. so... We're starting from the beginning. Gotcha. Yeah. I figured we should start from the beginning, not go too deep. Right. See, it's still... I still can't figure it out, because I'm still... So oh, you shit! Gotta jump. Attaboy. But you can only do one or the other. Right. You gotta. Have you played this game? Uh, <laughs> it doesn't mean I'm good at it. It definitely. I mean, it's nice that it takes you back to or a certain place. Yeah, and if you get stuck, you can always sit back by resetting. Oh, really? You can just go all the way back if you want. Yeah. So you can almost decide when you go back. That's cool. I'm getting better at this. Oh. And so these I mean, these green things are basically just collectibles in level. Oh, well, Ben's got a video to do. <laughs> There's in the top right tells you how many are each level. We'll go from there. Interesting. I just want to do one thing. Ah! Ben's doing weird stuff. I'm just trying to turn down the volume a little bit. Well, sorry. I, the gun noise was blowing my ears out. Right. So what's um, like, what audio? I mean, I can't hear audio, so you'll have to explain it's, that to everybody. It's a, a techno... I give it a techno feel, kind of 8-bitty, which is kind of cool. I like it. It seems to fit the vibe of the game. Fast-paced. Keeps it... So, I mean, kind of what you'd expect for a game that looks like this. Yeah, exactly. I, I, I'm really liking the mechanics. Like, the... It feels kind of Flappy Bird-ish with... You know, you have to hold it to fire your gun for longer... So you're kind of doing that up and down bob, which is neat. Mm -hmm. I like the fact how there's, you know, you use your gun in both directions, but you can only use it one at a time. Right. Right. Because I've seen Who's some of these guy? where you can jump. I don't know. It's my question. Okay. It's a narrator, and it the narrator changes up very often in this. Interesting. And now is there a story that we're following? Um, just... the world is the sun is dying. You know, oh. it's going to take us all with it, so we're trying to escape. Interesting. So pretty, I feel pretty simple storyline. You may need more than a machine gun. Maybe. To Whoa. get away from this. Jeez. Whoa. Oh, I missed two, damn it. Why didn't you get those, Ben? Because there's big saws in the way. You're a big saw, you little maggot. Uh, That's what he said. So. But I mean, overall, uh, I like it so far. It's kind of cool. Lots of. It's got an interesting art style to it. That's for sure. I mean... The background kind of has like a rainbow alternating yeah. well, thing. Yeah, it, it reminds me neat. like Terraria-ish, where the the background's kind of doing its thing, and then it's, your foreground's the yeah. important stuff. But it yeah, adds it's kind a nice of stationary. texture. Fuck. Yeah. Had a boy. Just got caught. You know, Ooh. I'm actually. I was gonna say I was impressed with how well you're doing. But... Well, I'm getting greedy for the atomics. I'll be honest. Right. And I, I did play it a little bit just to get a feel for what I was going to be doing. Do you even care about our story? Ah! Sure. See, and I, I find the, the narrator's a little witty in that regard, right? Where well, like, that's good. Makes it entertaining. 
okay, it's starting to get a little more intense. Just wait, there's there's like one part where it just ramps up a thousand percent. You're ignoring all these words, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> I like well, if people, oh, if man. people want to read the story, they can read the story. Yeah. I mean, if there, if there was a story, which there is. Well, I wouldn't but... want to ruin the game for them. We just want to show them the mechanics and go with it. So that that is section one, simple and easy. Oh boy. I, I feel uh, like apparently... even Savvy could do this. I don't know about that. I feel like it. Ah, uh, we'll see. Jesus. <laughs> he he! Look at Birdie shoot her. Oh, oh no! <laughs> well, that's where I put the game down. Oh, I did it! How is that even possible? <laughs> just wait, just wait. You like playing on our planet? It's gonna explode soon. Oh my gosh! I mean, it's got to be said oh, for shit. somebody who can create these games. Just the amount of timing it takes to make it yeah. so that there is yeah. a possible way to do it. Well, and what I know? love in this is that the atomics basically show you where to go. Yeah. Which is awesome. I mean, like, it's extremely easy to make a difficult level that's impossible. Yeah. But to make a difficult level that is possible, that's, that's the impressive thing. Yeah. And, like, I feel like... I, I love how challenging these are. I, that last level I spent quite a bit of time on before. When I was first playing it. And now you just nailed it. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's nice that the atomics actually show you where to go. Yeah. Kind, in, a, in a way. It's like, you can take this path. And it will likely give you the chance. But yeah. there's so many other Maybe. ones. You can skip level. Interesting. Apparently you can skip levels. That's what the little narrator guy says. So it's got to be levels? true. Jesus. Oh, now, is this the that. farthest you've gotten? <clears throat> no. I think Why I are you reading? You should be shooting. Well, where did I go? So I'm on 15 right now, and I got up to like 40. 30. Yeah, I got. Oh! Yeah, I got up to 30. So I'm about halfway huh. to where I was. But that's not oh, bad. I'm guessing, I'm guessing those bars are. That's how, how many, many atomics? atomics you got? Yeah, so I have yet. I don't think I've cleared a single level full of atomics. Wow. So, nope. like, it gives you such opportunity, oh fuck, to go back and try to optimize. Fuck. Sounds like a Ben thing to do with these <laughs> Shit. This might be the one where I call it. Ah! How many times do I die before we call it? I don't, I don't know. But I, I, the... I like how quick it is. Like, it's just like, oh, you fuck up, you're back to the start, you're going. Yeah, there's not like the continue button, yeah. which is extremely frustrating. Okay, did you see that one, Jesse? I, yeah. The, I knocked it and then hit it as it was falling, and it yeah, killed Yeah, well, that me. was silly. Why'd you do that? Fuck. But it's just like interesting so that, mechanics that I didn't even have to deal with last time. No, that's pretty neat. I, I mean, usually once you shoot something and these things, they just disappear, but that's cool that they added it. Yeah, so. the gravity is... Fuck. <laughs> I'll give you this, you got farther than I would have got, that's for sure. Um, Fuck. This, this yeah. bouncing between is interesting, though. Okay, do you mean? I think that's it. I think that's it. Yeah. I'm embarrassing so, myself too much. What is it? That's Run Gun Jump Gun. Yeah. On the, Steam, or how on much mobile. was it? Uh, it? I got it for like four bucks during the auto yeah, sale. I, I think it's I up at think, nine now. Okay, because I know on mobile I saw it at, it was like three fifty. Oh, that's pretty sweet. I, so... And it, um, like, totally a simple mobile game that you can pull out whenever and just go. Uh, it's just two buttons, right? Yeah. So nothing too intensive. Think... Um, put out by Thirty Three is the developer. Yeah. So I don't know. I I like it. I'm not a huge fan of this kind of game, but I feel like it's fast paced enough and interesting enough that I would come back to it. And every time I'm progressing a level, there's something new that I'm having to deal with and think through. So I, I, yeah, I, I would it, definitely recommend it, guys. I, don't I mean, know, why thoughts? not? I mean, I hate these games. <laughs> I know you do. Not, not to be that guy, but it looked neat. Um, I'll give it that for sure. Yeah. I, yeah. Uh, I enjoyed watching you play it. Of course. I you don't did. know if I, I don't know if I'd try it. It's just, you know, it's rage-inducing mm -hmm. for me. But what? people like that. There's, there's a market for that for four, sure. Four different levels to play. So there's four, how many did it? So there's 40 in oh. the first one, so I'm guessing 80 
probably 120 and then whatever the sun is. Right. That's pretty good. So for ru running away from the sun, you're running towards it, though. I don't or know. Or maybe you're going to save the world. You have to play the storyline and find out, guys. Yep. Um, so that's it. Let us it. know in the comments. Yeah. I did just see what you guys think of it. Throw it down in the comments below. Um, if you enjoy this video, don't forget to smash that like button. If you enjoy the game, buy it. Support the developers. Um, they are a very small, small developer company. So it's always nice to see these indie games take off. So if you like it, toss them some love. Savvy, thank you for joining me, even though I know you were pulling your hair out watching. <laughs> yeah, it's just nightmares were coming into mind. It's like, I couldn't do it. Yeah. But I'm glad you could, so. Perfect. Well, thank you as always for watching, guys, and we'll see you all next time. Bye. Bye.